to speak to Ando Herrera. So just keep watching it, right? Right, everyone, we've got a very special guest, Mr. Ander Herrera. Hello. Firstly, congratulations on the Europa League win. Thank you very much. I mean, what did it feel like, like with the trophy? European trophy is always yeah. a nice feeling. Every trophy is a nice feeling, but of course, Europa League was the, the only trophy United missed. To win, yeah. So now, three trophies this season. Uh, Champions League next season, I think everyone, everything was good. No, I, I enjoyed the final as well, you know, I was hoping United would win, so uh, good performance from yourself as well. Thank you. So, uh, obviously, you're an ex player. <laughs> um, why do you think the ex suits your game? To be honest, I look for the comfortability. Is good that word? Comfortability. Comfort, yeah. Comfort. Comfort, yeah. <laughs> I, I just try to be comfy, and I'm very comfy with them. Uh, I play with no laces, or at least they are hidden. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's, I am quite um, maniatic with the boots. I like to 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 wear them few times before playing okay. and with the cows I feel very good since the first day they adapt to your to your food very very very, yeah. very quick also when they are when they are wet you don't feel the boot heavy yeah it's, so it's that's very important and I'm very happy with them oh, that's good. Uh, I'm, I like the X as well <laughs> um, so obviously it was a great season for United next season do you have any goals or Obviously the Champions League, or do you think it's the Premier League might be the more important? Or? Always you have goals, you have things to improve. In Premier League we should have done it better this season. Of course three trophies you cannot complain, but we should have done it better in Premier League. And that's our first aim. And of course when you are in Champions League and you are Manchester United, you have to try to, to, to fight and to try to win every game. You, you know it's difficult to do it because there are big big teams and very good teams but uh, Manchester United need to be fighting for 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 Champions League uh, it's too soon to, to talk about the trophy or whatever yeah, but yeah. Uh, now the first thing I have in my mind is European Super Cup we are waiting for the opponent uh, we will know it on Saturday who do you think is gonna win the Champions League final to be honest I don't know I'm very bad predicting the, the winner uh, and I don't care. I just want to, to win the European Super Cup. Doesn't matter the, the opponent. I'll do it as well. I hope you do as well. <laughs> Thank you. So, as a footballer, what do you think your best attribute on the pitch is? I think I try to give everything every game and every time I'm on the pitch. Sometimes you can play good, sometimes you cannot play as good as. <laughs> as all the days, but uh, I just try to give everything. I just try to make our fans proud. Uh, as soon as I get into the pitch, I like to to, to fight. I like to to try to win every ball, and I think our fans appreciate that. Uh, they forgive you if you make a mistake, and you give everything after. So, we, want, we really want to know, because you know you've got Jesse Lingard, you've got Paul Pogba, dancing around. Who is the worst dancer at Manchester United? I think uh, the Spanish group. Really? We are not so good dancers. I'm, I'm not a good dancer, really. I think... Um, I've never seen, to be honest, Wayne Rooney or Michael Carrick dancing because I think they, they don't try. <laughs> but when we try to do it in front of the, the dancers, they laugh. So that means we are not doing so well. So. No, no, they're just jealous. Ah, okay, you can, you can jealous. really okay. dance. Thank you very dance. much. <laughs> Thank you very much, Andrew Herrera. Thank you.